On Saturday evening, a tanker carrying chemical gas rammed into traffic and burst into flames. I was driving this vehicle, my own. I was driving my own vehicle, and when we got here, I heard a sound from a distance, and when I looked, I saw fire. I tried to save my mother. According to police officials, 14 cars were affected, including a police car, which was the first to be hit. The confirmed report from the traffic police is that three people confirmed dead from this incident. The number might increase. According to some witnesses, the driver of the tanker lost control while approaching a speed bump along the Nairobi Nakuru Highway, about 10 kilometers from the central town of Naivasha. Emergency and recovery efforts were still underway by mid morning on Sunday. Bodies have been taken to a local mortuary where family members have begun identifying them. Police say the next phase is DNA testing, given that most bodies were burnt beyond recognition. According to Kenya's National Transport and Safety Authority, the rate of road accidents increased in 2016 by 45 percent compared to the previous year. Authorities say the tanker was not even licensed to drive at night and on that particular highway. Many Kenyans are now demanding an explanation from relevant authorities. Catherine Omwando, CCTV.